I went ahead and put my film on the reel in the dark and it's now in this canister. In part one of this video, we prepared all of our chemicals, so now we're ready to move on to developing. I like to have everything set up prior so I'm not fumbling around. Again, do this in the bathroom or bathtub just to prevent any spills. On my laptop next to me, I have a website set up with multiple timers. Each step takes a different length of time, so you need to be as accurate as possible. I always start with a one minute water rinse prior to starting developing. Start my timer, and this is going to be for one minute. Make sure your water is at the appropriate temperatures, and it's good to pour it as fast as possible, just because every second counts. Try to be as even as possible when you're agitating your film. So next is the developer. I'm going to start my next timer. And using the massive development chart in part one, we know our times for developing. Um, so for HP5 400 ISO, it's 5.5 minutes. I'm going to start agitating for the first minute and then you're going to agitate for 5 seconds every 30 seconds for the full 5.5 minutes. And it's good to hit it down on the, on the surface because it releases all the bubbles that may be developing onto the film. Alright, so we have a few seconds left. Going to put this inside of here to prevent any spills when I uh, put the chemicals back inside. All right. So the next step is the stop bath, and as I mentioned before, that's to stop the development process. And you only need to do this for 30 seconds. So I'm starting my timer now and you'll agitate for the full 30 seconds. Again, try to pour this as quick as possible because every second counts to the time. So again, we're going to agitate it every 30 seconds for five seconds. So 10 minutes has passed since I washed my film. I took it off the reel, but everything looks pretty good. Again, do this in a bathroom because it is so messy. If I'm in a rush, I'll take a blow dryer with medium heat and I'll dry this. But since I have the time, I'm just gonna hang this in the shower and just let it dry naturally. I'm just gonna take a clothespin and just hang it like that. But the development times were great, the exposure was great, everything turned out really well. Let me know if you guys have any questions about this whole process. Let me know if you have any tips for doing this all at home. And thanks again for watching. Bye.